questions. So Ellie, um, do you use perfume? Um, yes, I, um, I like perfume and I usually wear it on my body. Wow, eventually I find somebody love to use perfume. So <laughs> I saw down and I never bought it really. <laughs> so I'll find it one at least. I think it's uh, I think it's um I think it's my luck that to bring you here because <laughs> the conversation <laughs> is dry right now. <laughs> conversation is dry. <laughs> okay. All right. Um I've made a good decision. Okay, so uh, what kind of perfume do you like to use? Um I like um the perfume with the light smell. Um, Lots it's not too mm -hmm. strong smell, mm -hmm. and um, Dior is my favorite uh, perfume brand name. Oh, uh, Dior, yeah, Dior. Everybody talk about Dior. So, um, okay, so, um, mm. okay, so you have many kinds of perfume, right? So, in what situation you use what kind of perfume? What kind of perfume? you use in each situation. Can you give us uh, advice, a knowledge about it? The choosing the right perfume for the right situation. Actually, I, I, um, I don't have a lot of knowledge about the, the perfume, how to use it. Um, but uh, I think in the basically, um, I choose a light smell in mm -hmm. uh, a fresh smell in uh, daytime and maybe a uh, strong smell in the evening. Um, yeah, and uh, in the crowded air, a crowded, um, crowded, yeah, crowded area, uh, area. Uh, some occasion with, with many people, mm -hmm. uh, I, I don't use the strong smell. It yeah. will make another person uh, mm -hmm. feel very tired with that mm -hmm. smell. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. All right, so light perfume used in the daytime and strong perfume, strong smell perfume used in either evening usually. So yeah. in a crowded area, you use the light smell because you don't want to uh, get uh, people un annoyed and uh, discom yeah. discomfortable, uncomfortable. Okay. Okay. So, uh, would you pay? Would you pay? Um, would you pay a lot for perfume? No, it's uh, it's not the here the uh, the big amount of money to mm -hmm. uh, use uh, for the perfume. Mm -hmm. uh, even though I use it every day, but uh, around a year, <laughs> I, I use just one bottle. Uh, okay. So what, I we, mean, what I mean, have you ever walked, like you probably traveling, like Isler and Bonnie Ellie, you probably traveling abroad. Have you guys traveled abroad? Yes, I do. Brought. Anna, you have a bro travel abroad, right? And I Isla, you travel abroad, right? Yes. Bonnie? Travel outside of Vietnam? Yes. Okay, so you guys are probably walk by the perfume shop in international at some international airports. All right. So uh um, my question is that do you you want to buy so for for Ellie so you probably like this one but you want to buy this one I'm um, not in the airport like in twin traveling you see that and you want to buy that have you ever um, and also the look at the price tag price tag you see that it's a 100 100 dollars or 200 dollars would you like to pay that? Yes, I will. <laughs> yeah, because you know, um, in Vietnam, you ha you 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 have to pay the same 
um, the firm, the with same tax. bottle, with the, tax, the same right? bottle with very high tax, oh, yeah. so that uh, you should, if you you go abroad, is a um, great change for you. Mm -hmm. So you should try to buy everything you think <laughs> that is cheaper than in Vietnam. <laughs> So, and okay. you have the free tax, so it's nice with yeah. the with the uh, thing with the um, thing that is the high value mm -hmm. with that with with that tax is a good thing for me. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So I will. Um, so I, I I want him uh, uh walk by the Italian um uh, Italian perfume shop, and there is a sample. There are samples outside of outside of stores doorstep outside, and there are three bottles. Like everybody else, I was curious. What is that? Uh, what was that? So I I walked up, I walked right up to the place to the doorstep, and I saw people spray it. Ah, perfume. Okay, so I want to try it out. Like I test it out. Like I test the first smell, the bottle, the first bottle. I smell it. It was too strong. I couldn't. Okay, no thanks. No seconds. No seconds bottle. I I was like projecting. I was uh, uh giving a, a an impression. Do Italian people use a strong smell like that? You know what I mean? They like So projecting. I'm projecting. Um, I'm projecting. Um, um, I am uh, having an impression that do Italians people use this smell, strong smell, a lot? Because I don't like it at all. You know what I mean? Okay. So, all right. So, Ali. Um, well, one last question. Do you use gift? Do you give uh, perfume as gift to someone? Yes. Do you do? Um, I know the the perfume is the very expensive. Yeah. Um, but um, I think a good relationship is worthy of it. Um, um. So, um, if you and um, it's more respectful and uh, uh, it's more is respectful. Yeah. If if you know the the what kind of smell that person like and oh, yeah. what brand name they prefer, wow. so it is a wonderful gift to him or her. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think is if we uh, we know a friend and we uh, we know he's well, what brand he uses and what brand she she uses and what smell she likes and what smell he doesn't like and so when we give that this feeling like we cared we they are they're being taken care of and we care of them and it's good to build a good relationship that's good ali you have a knowledge on that ali 